Hubert Sanders here, a great way to gauge market sentiment, in other words, the fear and greed of the market, is to follow a lot of the big high flyers. So uh, there's a lot of speculation in, so it'll give you a really good edge on what's going on in the market. So one of them is Apple. Apple does not act bad. It does not act good. It just acts kind of blah. So what you need to do is take a handful of stocks like Apple. You also go look G-O-O-G, if I can type correctly. G well, G-O-O-G, hitting the buttons too fast. Google doesn't act wonderful. It's below the cloud, and the lagging line is below the cloud. So we have Apple that's eh. We've got Google that's Eh, now let's take a look at Amazon, A-M-Z-N. A lot of this has got to do with the gridlock. Amazon actually looks pretty good. It's above the cloud. Lagging line is above the cloud. So we've got two up. We've got one sideways, one down, and one up. And then take a look at in, in Netflix, N-F-L-X, not Z-X. Netflix acts wonderful, looking good. So we've got one up, one down. Uh, I'm sorry, one down, one sideways, and two up. So overall, that's a positive expectancy that the market will probably grind higher. Good luck. Hope it helps. See you on the next video.